The scriptures say man's goings are of the Lord. How then can he find his own way? You wouldn't be here right now. I wouldn't be here right now. We wouldn't be sitting here connecting right now if it wasn't for the Lord. You see what I'm saying? Everything is of the Lord. Everything is of the Lord. And I'm just going to bring out a few scriptures real quick. Bring out a few scriptures, man. I, re I record it because, you know, this is this is a teaching moment. We're in a, we're, 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 we 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 got to teach our people. They got to relearn because what they've learned in the world, they don't know this. What they've learned in the world is is not is not. Uh, I ain't gonna put you on camera like that oh, here. It doesn't matter. It doesn't bother me. Man, I'm just I'm just I'm, I'm about to, I'm about to preach the word, man. I'm about to preach the word, man. Hey, you good, man? That's all. It's all good, man. I'm about to preach the word of the Lord, man. You know what I'm saying? And I had a lesson. I got a lesson drawn out, okay, certain, certain things, but hey, these people here on this chart, the 12 tribes of Israel, man, that's who we are, you know what I'm saying, let me take this hat off, because we are not to preach with our head covered, that's a part of the law, do you, do you follow the law, statutes, commandments, no, huh, it said that, uh, <laughs> hey, we can't live. We can't. We can't follow Mal Char. I mean, or else we'd be sacrificing animals and stuff. Like we can't do all that. You know, we work on the Sabbath sometimes. We can't. We can't skip work to to for the Sabbath sometimes, man. Sometimes. So so what we're supposed to do is uh do as much as we can, the best as we can, man. Like I said, you're supposed to have a beard, man. A man is supposed to have a beard, man. Okay, we're supposed to have a beard. We're supposed to we're, we're supposed to not prophesy with our head covered. Uh, a bunch of things, man. According to the laws, man, in Deuteronomy, what's Deuteronomy mean? You know what Deuteronomy is? That's the book of the law, man. You know what I'm saying? So we out here, man. Basically, my message is, man, we prophesy to the twelve tribes of Israel, man. That's on this chart right here. You so-called American blacks, Judah. Did you know that our Lord Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ? It's from the tribe of Judah. So he looked like you. You see that picture down there at that church? You you, remember, you seen it? The, the middle one? Yeah, the so-called brown-skinned yeah. Jesus? Hey, that's how he looks, man. You, you, do you believe that? You, you believe that? Well, why did everybody give us a, a, a so-called white man picture, man? And it ain't nothing against the white man. I mean, it, we we are against his, his ancestors and his, his, what he represents. But hey, some hey, we live in those days where we gotta come back to the truth, man. Can I read you something real quick, man? Let me read you something real quick, man. Okay, because our Lord ain't no ain't no damn uh, pale dude, man. Let me read you something real quick. See, I had a lesson planned out, but hey, the spirit gotta go where it gotta go. Let's go to Revelations. Have you ever read Revelations? Do you believe that the Revelations are open? Do you believe that the seals are broken? Do you believe that in this book right here, and everything it says, do you believe yes, it? I know. Do I know. you believe it though? Yes. All right, let's go to it. Dude. This is the book of Revelations. First and foremost, man, hey, let me give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rahaka Kodesh. Okay, double honors to my apostles and elders, a great millstone who rule well, teach well, peace. Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect, the hopeful elect, okay, because the Lord is coming to save his elect this time around. In the time of Egypt, he was saving all Israel, but this time he's only saving his elect from these tribes. These are 12 tribes of Israel, the sons, okay, and daughters of Jacob that came from Abraham and Isaac into Jacob. The covenant was given to these people. On this chart, these people on this chart are brothers and sisters scattered abroad. How many times have you heard that throughout the yeah. scriptures? Scattered abroad. So we we're, we're pushing the message to our people that in these times, man, we got to wake up, man. So let me read this to you real quick. What does this mean? This is this is Revelations, okay? And I'll go to uh, yep, yeah, Revelations chapter one, and I'll start here. And verse 12. And I turned to see the voice that spake with me. And this is uh, 
you know, John, John, John the Revelator, okay? And turned and saw seven golden candlesticks. And in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man. Now, who's the Son of Man? Huh? You call him yeah, Jesus. <laughs> His name is Yahweh Shai. Cloth with the garment down to the foot and girt about the pets with a golden girdle. Okay, so he had a garment down to the foot. Okay. It says his head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were a flame of fire. Okay, so the, 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 the picture of the uh, white man Jesus that you see, is his head white like wool? No, it's not. Okay. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. And his voice as the sound of many waters. So this is talking about Jesus. His name ain't Jesus. His name is Yahweh Shah. So it says his feet like unto fine brass. What color is brass? But if you put that brown color in the furnace and burn it, what color would it be? Black. Like me and you. Okay? And, 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 and we're not black. We're, we're, we're dark, dark brown. The, the, the word black, if you ever look it up inside the dictionary, it, it has all types of negative. You know what I'm saying? Have you ever looked up the word black in your dictionary? You got a phone? Look up the word black, man. See how many negativity, how much negativity that word black brings out. Man. Okay? As, as opposed to the word white. And then you'll see, man. See, there's a covering cast, man. There's a covering cast over us, man. People want us to believe that our God, our Lord, is a so-called white man. And it ain't no, hey, it ain't about race. Hey, it's about facts, okay? What did we just read? Let me read it again. It says his head, Revelations chapter 1, verse 14. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow. And his eyes were a flame of fire. So... That white man Jesus that they put up in the churches all these thousands of years, he don't look nothing like this account in Revelations, man. He has long blonde or brown hair. His hair and wool, what's wool do? It, it curls. Who the only people on earth that have curly hair? Black people, so-called Negroes, right? Our Lord was from the tribe of Judah, which was which would be our color, man. Our people. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow, and his eyes were a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. Fine brass burned in a furnace. That's brown. That's extra, extra dark brown. So why is the lie pushed out in this world that our Lord is a so-called white man. When it tells you clearly, hey, one plus one is two to me. Right? So why hasn't nobody in the church read this? Did your church read you this? Why not? They read it, but no, 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 the understanding no. of it has changed. No, it hasn't changed. It says it. And the scriptures tell you, the Lord, in the law, it tells you don't add or take away from my word. Well, that, 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 that's okay. But the truth says it right here. One plus one is two, right? So why are these teaching? Why are these churches telling you that one plus one is eleven? Oh, you just add the one and you put it here and you you just stick them together and tie a knot around it. No, it says it right here. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow. And his eyes a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in the furnace. Fine brass, as if they burned in the furnace. Think on that. Okay? Our Lord is a so-called dark-skinned man. And he's not coming to save everybody, man. Who's he, who's he coming to save? He's coming to save these people. That's been a demon. She's been walking around for four years. Hey, the 12 tribes of Israel, that's who he's coming to save, man. He's not coming to save all these people. 
unless they're from these tribes. And they, they can be white, they can be Chinese, they can be... But if their forefathers go back to this, they're, they're of us, man. They're of us. It don't, it don't matter the color. It's not a colored thing. These devils, the so-called white man made it a colored thing when he put a white Jesus in every single church. When it clearly tells you what color our Lord is right here. Okay? It clearly tells you what color our Lord is, man. So what my message is today is to come down and sit in the dust. See, we're living in a day of information. We're living in a day of these people getting their due, okay? Because all the things that they've done to us, all the lies, the covering cast, okay? All this, oh, white man Jesus stuff, you know what I'm saying? Hey, all of it's coming down to the wire right now. Everybody's finding out about these people, man. So what my message is today is to come down and sit in the dust, oh, virgin daughter of Babylon. Did you know America is in the Bible? Oh, it's through it's it's throughout the Bible. It's called uh, Babylon. It's called uh, you know it's called uh, Mystery Babylon, Mystery Babylon, the mother of harlots. Okay, and we can read that here in the Book of Revelations also. Let me get that Revelation chapter seventeen, right? Do you know America's in the Bible, man? America's in the Bible, man. Okay, this is Revelation chapter seventeen. Okay? Sir, you can't do that on library property. Huh? You can't do this on library property. This is a like private property? You cannot do that on library property. Oh, I thought I could. So, Hey, so they're kicking me out from the property because I'm preaching the word of the Lord. But I thought public libraries were for, you know. Hey, it is what it is, man. The scriptures tell you to agree with thine adversary while thou art in the way with him. So they're kicking me out from the, 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 the library. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to have to go somewhere else. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. I'll, I'll take my ass right across the street and continue to preach this word. How about that? We're going to continue to preach this word of the Lord. The word of the Lord is going to go through. It's going to go forth no matter what. It's going to go forth no matter what, man. Can't do it on library property. Yeah, okay. Damn cracks, 